In this video, we're crafting a makeup beauty book for our dolls. It's fun because you can fold it up and take it on the go. To start, get a piece of scrap paper board and mark where your beauty book will fold. It will be about an inch and a half tall, and then each section in the beauty book is an inch wide, and in between, you need to mark 3 16 4 16 and then 6 16 even a little bit bigger than that in between is okay, but you don't want it too small or it won't fold up. Now score on the lines in between each one inch section. Make sure not to cut all the way through the paperboard. You're just gonna lightly score it so you can bend it. Now cut it out and you should be able to completely fold it up. If it doesn't fold up or fit together at this point, you need to start over until it does. Paint your beauty book whatever color you want. We're going with a basic black, but a shiny silver would be nice also. For the makeup compartments, you'll need a scrap piece of craft foam. I'm using the same color that I painted the outside of my beauty book so it all blends together. Each section should be under an inch and a half tall and under an inch wide. You want it to fit inside without hanging over. For the mirror, I'm using a scrap piece of reflective scrapbook paper. You only need a teeny tiny piece and then you can glue it to one of the makeup sections. For the eyeshadow, punch out a few holes with a hole punch. For the blush and the lipstick, I'm using an X-Acto knife to cut out a rectangle and four small squares. For the last section, I'm using scrap pieces of paper to make a concealer and a highlighter. Just glue them onto the section, and you can use different color paper if you'd prefer a different type of makeup here. Now it's time to add all the sections. Because I used a sticky back craft foam, I can just stick it onto the book. If you didn't, you can use glue to glue it in place. Make sure that you're applying these sections on the right side of the book so it folds up. The scored side should be on the back. Once all the sections are in place, we can fill up the empty spots. You can use whatever colors you want for this, and you can even make several beauty books with different color palettes. For the makeup itself, I am dripping in nail polish. I like how shiny it is. You can also use a puffy paint. Now for the finishing touch that sparkles. Once your makeup has dried, close up your beauty book and then add sparkle or glitter to the front cover. You can apply glue to the front and then sprinkle glitter on top, let it completely dry and you're done. Or if you have the crafting gems or jewels, you can glue those to the front also. Now you're done and your dolls have an adorable makeup beauty book. Speaking of makeup, I want to show you a really cool product that you can use on your dolls and it's safe. It's from Little Bitty Hearts and you get a package of eyeliner that you can stick on your dolls. This is the black option and there are two different eyeliner shapes in a solid black and a glittery black. They just peel off the package and you can stick them straight on your doll. I've done this several times now and it's easier to place on your doll if she's laying down so her eyes are closed and she's not shaking around standing up. If you don't like the placement, you can easily peel them off and try again. When your doll is done with the makeup for the day, you can peel them right off and place them back on the package it came with. 